and he is playing Gust. Oh, I cannot wait to talk about the Link Dimension with you all. We're immediately rushing into it. They don't need hand warmers. 6am, one thing that he is so good at doing with his Link play. He is great at maneuvering around the long times that it takes for the projectiles to really come out with Link. Like, Link is a character that re has really strong kill moves and fairly good comboing potential, but the problem is a lot of the moves that he uses to set up these combos take a little while, have a little bit of a longer startup lag, like the boomerang or his grenades. So, and then there's also the problem of mediocre at best recovery. But Six is just so great at using the tools he has to his advantage. Like, just there, one hit was really all he needed to, like, set up two up airs into a down air and really just apply constant pressure onto Gust. Ooh. Now, one thing that I've heard that is, an, is a strong idea for edge guarding with Link against Kirby is to really just throw one of the bombs really high up to try to make him wait it out while you figure out a new plan for the rest of the edge guard. But it's not something I really see Six do often. Okay, so now once again, he's pulled out a bomb while in his invincibility and has just thrown them around, waiting for Gus to really... He's really taunting him there. He's saying, come on, come and get me. I got these bombs. That's all I'm doing here. I'm running away. Come and get me. Just see, one bomb right there was all six needed to combo into his incredibly high damage and high knockback forward air. And he is just completely in Gust's head right now. Ooh, ah, oh, another forward air would have been amazing. Would have definitely cleared out the stock. Had no trouble getting out of that up tilt. Like, one thing that I need to learn is how to deal with that move. Kinda hard. Oh, there it is, up tilt, oh, neutral air. Great work from Six, keeping himself safe. Oh, there it is. Oh. And another reset into neutral, which led to a grab from Gust. <laughs> now really, all I would say that Gust needs to do is take advantage of Six's and Link's massive weight. He's like, Link is a character that really has trouble recovering and gets really, he's really easy to combo on. So all Gust really needs to do is find a way to, if he wants to start like performing better, he's got to find a way to maneuver around Link's projectiles. Because that's really where he's getting hit most. Like, Six will know exactly where he's going and how to put a projectile over there to stop him. And then whenever he does, like, he's kind of in Six's control. Good down air to finish off that stock, really taking advantage of Link's heavy weight and poor recovery options. Now, Gust is looking a little bit in risk, and that was indeed it. Game 1 goes to 6 a.m. Like I said, a lot of what he was doing so well was that he was keeping Gust under control by his projectiles, and really, like, I want to say controlling the flow of the game, but really he was mostly using them for stage control, trying to say where Gust could not couldn't go. Like, one thing that I've noticed Gus doing is that he pretty much has very consistently been recovering to the side plat, and Six has just been taking advantage of that by throwing boomerangs right over there to block him. Oh. Bomb going up into the air, and down it goes. The lead to an early 28%. Good down air from Gus to keep himself out of the boomerang's hitbox. Aw. 
but he was on a oh the up tilt frenzy leads to a strong neutral air and forward smash to end six's first stock like that's really all you need to do with kirby against the character like there's so many easy ways to edge guard him like it's all all gust really has to do is get one absurdly strong combo and six is in danger Six is playing like a madman today. It's amazing to watch. Oh, there are the up tilts. Aw, oh, misses the neutral air. Down tilt, and that's all it takes. 68%. Poor Link. It's hard knock life for those Link mains. Oh. Once again, Boomerang really going exactly where Six is expecting Gus to be. He is just in that man's head. Down smash, bomb. Ah, oh. Six hits himself with it, which really stops him from being able to continue his combo. But just seconds later, he was able to finish it off with, I think it was a forward tilt, but my eyes could be deceiving me. Recovers way off to the side, but Gust is free to edge guard with whatever he wants here. Doesn't even need to, just goes fallen off to the sea of torment that is the bottom of Dreamland. Oh. oh my. 68% with one combo, and that's two, a quick 2-0. I believe that was a zero to death. Duel, please set that as a replay, because that was amazing. I want to be watching that for days to come. Someone make a gif a cat of this, because it's gorgeous. Please. Put it in the... You know, someone submit this for Clip of the Week, because that was, that was just beautiful. Amazing Link play.